Hello everyone! In this guide we will show you how to set up, start and use live analysis in one sport video analyzer. First, in the main menu, click on the live analysis button. Next, you'll see a box where you need to enter the name of your project. This name will be used to save the project in the projects list. In the second box, you have two options to start live analysis, cameras and streamlinks. To start live analysis with streamlinks, simply paste the RTSP or M3U8 link into the box. To start live analysis with a camera, click on the arrow and select the desired camera from the drop-down list. After selecting the camera, two additional options will appear. By clicking on these boxes, you can change the resolution and the audio source of the footage being recorded by the camera. Note that these options are not available if you start live analysis with stream links. In the next box, choose the name and where to save the processed footage. All footage processed by live analysis is saved locally on the hard drive and can be used for post-match analysis. Next, you can set the bitrate. This can be adjusted in both stream and camera setups. The last option is to choose the template for your actions and labels. Now live analysis is ready to start. Whether you have started the live analysis process with a camera or a stream, the tagging functions and workflows remain the same. Once live analysis starts, it will open in live mode. Live footage from the stream or camera is played in the analyzer and at the same time is being saved to a local hard drive. In live mode, you can take clips and add markings, labels and notes, but it is not possible to pause, rewind or review tagged clips. By clicking on the live button, the software switches between live and delay mode. In delay mode, you can pause and rewind the footage, allowing you to tag, rewatch and edit those events. Finally, you can open drawing mode to add visualizations or to immediately export the video files. At any moment, you can click on presentation mode, which opens a new window with live footage. This ensures you won't miss any crucial moments of the game, whether you are searching, drawing or exporting clips. To stop live analysis, you must return to the main menu or shut down the software. After live analysis is completed, the footage will be saved on the local hard drive and in the project list making it quickly accessible for post-match analysis.